Okay, buckle up people. This is MLB. You already know who I am. Back with chapter 37 of Rapid Fate Online and this one's titled Butterfly vs Dragon. As you watched from where you hid, you could see the dragon was indeed glitching heavily at times and you waited to see what your man would do. Butterfly moved slightly, then shot forwards at lightning speed. You only just caught a glimpse of him before his chain whip wrapped around the beast's front leg and he yanked it back hard, but the dragon's leg glitched at that point and the chain whip sword slipped right through where the leg would have been, causing zero damage to the formidable foe. The dragon, upon seeing Butterfly right next to him, swung his head down and shot a bolt of lightning from his mouth, just narrowly missing Butterfly, who jumped back just in time. Butterfly readied himself again and lunged forwards, aiming for the dragon's neck, but the body glitched this time and Butterfly flew straight through the black scaly opponent. The dragon, angered now, whipped around and shot another lightning bolt at Butterfly, who didn't quite dodge it in time and the bolt struck his sword, conducting the lightning perfectly and scorching Butterfly's hand. You gasped and covered your mouth in fear when you saw Butterfly's charred skin. Your anxieties increasing when you saw just how much health had been drained from Butterfly in just that one attack. If he keeps getting hit like that, it will only take seven or eight goes before that dragon drains all his health. That's if he doesn't stop to use health potions, but I don't think he has time to stop and revive. You watched helplessly as Butterfly tried a few more tactics, but each time his attack got thwarted by the dragon's glitch. Finally, Butterfly drew back and opened his menu quickly swiping and clicking on something before closing the tabs back down. Another sword materialised on his left hip and you looked at it curiously. What is that? Another sword? Is Butterfly a dual wielder like Kirito? You were so engrossed in your own curiosities that you didn't hear a female player sneak up behind you. Oh yes, she suddenly said as her head popped past yours to lean around the corner. I haven't missed a fight. What the heck? you whisper screamed. Where the hell did you come from? Get out of here, it's dangerous. <laughs> like, hell I'm leaving now. Butterfly's about to fight and I want to see it. Yeah, but it's not safe here. You need to go, you replied emphatically. And what about you? You're here. Shouldn't you be going? She shot back in a snarky tone. I'm his girlfriend. I ain't going nowhere, you retorted. Oh, damn, seriously? Lucky bitch. I'd kill to be dating Butterfly, the female player sighed. Kill? You questioned suspiciously. Figure of speech, babes, chill ya, she replied flippantly, turning her attention back to your man. Oh, hell yeah, he's gonna use the rapier, she squealed in a hushed tone. The what? You asked in a deadpan voice. Rapier, you know, thin, stabby sword thing. He doesn't use it often, but he's fucking badass when he does. Holy, he's going to jewel wield, hell yeah. Okay, you need to calm down, you said with slight amusement. You know a lot about Butterfly and his fighting habits. Yeah, I'm a huge fan. The guy's a legend. Uh, that's my man you're talking about, you replied smugly. Okay, no need to rub it in, she replied in a repulsed tone, eyeing you from the corner of her eye. A loud roar drew both your attention back to the fight, and you watched as Butterfly stood in a very open stance, with the chain whip sword in his right hand and rapier in his left. The dragon shot another ream of lightning at Butterfly, and the bolt connected with the chain whip sword, sparks flying from the middle. You shut your eyes at the light and then opened them to see what had happened to your man, but he wasn't where you last saw him. Where'd he Yes, bitch! The enthusiastic player hollered from beside you. He got him! You shushed her heavily and then looked back at the dragon. Butterfly had managed to place a hit across the dragon's left shoulder and was now behind the beast. Whoa, what happened there? I didn't see it, you asked puzzled. He's using one sword as a decoy, your female companion squealed excitedly. What? How? What? The confusion was evident in your voice. Seriously, she deadpanned. Watch him closely. You turned your attention back to Butterfly, who had now shot forwards and misplacing another hit on the glitching dragon as he passed him, and was now back in front of the fearsome creature. He bent down and picked up the chain whip sword that he had dropped previously and held, held both swords out either side of him again. This time, when the dragon spat more lightning, he used his chain whip to attack, wrapping it around the dragon's left leg and shattering it into a million crystals. The dragon roared and went down on his side, allowing Butterfly to execute a few more well-placed hits, finally defeating the beast and bursting it into a flurry of million brilliant crystals. I still don't understand what happened. You whispered to the player, who was silently fangirling beside you. 
the dragon was targeting his sword because it learned that metal conducted electricity and increased the damage done to butterfly so butterfly called another sword forward so he had it as an attack item when the dragon targeted one sword he dropped it at the last second and used the other one to attack it momentarily caught the dragon's attention and allowed butterfly to open an opening which he used perfectly she gushed i don't think the dragon glitches when it attacks either what's with this dragon hey it has a strange algorithm they don't usually learn attack patterns maybe that's why it's glitching because it's an ai or it's become sentient Ugh, sentient dragons no thanks okay wow that was a lot of information to take in you said slightly shocked so in short butterfly's amazing and dragon is possibly sentient yeah not sure about the dragon but butterfly is a god yes the player said to you before turning her attention to butterfly and calling out to him oh my god butterfly that was amazing i love you she suddenly shouted as she stepped out from hiding butterfly whipped around in surprise he hadn't thought that anyone had been watching him oh um thank you he replied to her humbly putting his rapier back in virtual storage where did you come from are you okay oh i was hiding with your girlfriend in the rat suit she said casually rat kink huh i can get behind that butterfly blushed oh um i like animals he said softly and there ends chapter 37. Stay tuned for chapter 38.